Hello everyone. In the previous video, we successfully generated our Hello World PDF and now the time is to create our PDF using Blade, right? So let me close them out here. So this one is our project and here I'm going to create a new view file. So let's go to the resources, views and here I'm going to name this so uh, let me create a file i'm creating the folder so it's a uh, index so or you can say that pdf oh, let me name this so uh, index so you can understand it better php here and in the index i'm going to point to hello from pdf blade right hello from we can say that index blade so it will print this hello from index blade we basically we are going to render this blade into our pdf file so how to do this so let's go back to the controller and in the controller we are passing this so hello world right we are passing this so load html and then we are passing this html so how to pass this uh, view file so let's go to the documentation so documentation clearly tell us that we need to uh, use this like this we need to call this uh, load uh, uh, load view right and then let me copy this from the documentation i'm going to uh, copy this uh, first you need to add this uh, at the top so you can also use this uh, use uh, pdf like this so it's totally upon you you can also add the full path here so let's uh, close this out and here you need to type pdf and this would be a pdf why it's not loading this out and then you need to call this a load view here like this so let me go back to the documentation so it's a pdf and then load view and yes it's correct and then we are going to download this so here you need to pass your blade view so it will by default load it from this view directory so it will by default look at this uh, looking in the view directory so we are going to uh, pass this index so we are going to render this index blade that's why we are simply passing this index without mentioning any directory so it will looking for this index blade and now it will look into this so uh, open this index file and we are not going to pass any other parameters why because we are not going to add any dynamic values first we are going to generate a simple blade and download it as pdf so let's save this one and go back and give it a refresh and yes the pdf is downloaded and uh, let me open this out and yes now it's printing that hello hello from index blade so it means that we are now successfully able to generate the pdf using dom pdf uh, using a custom blade right so we successfully created our successfully rendered this blade into our project so let me check the video size our video size is not going bigger so you can also print whatever you want so in the next video we are going to generate a, a beautiful design and then we are going to render this into our template and then we are going to move to the further so next video is going very amazing so don't forget to watch this out so i will meet you in the next one bye bye